it's your monk doing another reaction today we're reacting to a music video this is bia timberland this is i'm not uh, <laughs> apologize these are one takes i don't practice anything beforehand but <laughs> this is i'm that bitch um so yeah uh, I heard a few of Bia songs. Uh, I haven't been a big of a fan of Bia, but um, I like her voice and everything. Um, she tends to be pretty interesting. Um, and then you have Timberland. Timberland is a legend in the business, great producer, um, created some amazing hits for different artists Justin Timberlake, Missy Elliott, uh, Aaliyah. Like, he's created some, some bangers for a lot of these artists. So, like, Interested to see exactly how this goes, how this sounds. Um, hopefully, it'll be pretty, pretty good. So, let's go ahead and check this out and see exactly how this goes. Yeah. Oh, you're using the Missy Ella beat? beat? Yeah. Okay. Pause right here for a moment. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to figure out how I really feel about the song. <laughs> um, like it's all it's all right. The the they changed up the beat a little bit. The Missy Elliott, um, uh, like Timberland created the Missy Elliott blew up and stuff with, um, one of her her bangers, um, which was uh, she's a bitch. <laughs> Now you got uh, I'm That Bitch. Uh, I don't... I don't know. It's like some elements and stuff with it of how she's riding in the beat uh, kind of throws me off a bit. Um, and it's only like on some parts. Because I was like, it's not the beat necessarily. More it's just how she's laying it out exactly on the beat. Um, how she's riding it. So I was like, I don't... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Because I'm like conflicted. I'm really conflicted. A bit, but yeah. But that's just me, though. It might not be everyone else. Like again, how I feel about the song again is just me. It's not everyone else. If you really love the song and how it goes, hey, like. But just for me, I feel like that there's um, it's something that's that either like missing or something that's um. That needs to change a bit for it. But I was like, I don't know. But let's go ahead and continue. <laughs> So you couldn't reach me I'm the truth without getting too preachy Fuck do I look like letting him treat me I'm the type to go get my respect Probably gon' die with my foot in their neck I ended up cause I know when they press Sending him home cause he know he a guest Like, I'm a real bitch so I do what I wanna This nigga toxic ain't needed my son. I can tell you was a hoe from your aura I limit my drama, I'm having good comments Write me a house boy if you wanna be with me You used to women that's fucking too easily I used to get she looks a lot illegally like. my haters are sick when it's peacefully Huh? She's a fist I'm that Like this shot, and this another shot. She she looks just like uh, Cardi B a little bit. And I was like, I think it's just how she has her hair, and then everything she. My coat, okay. Oh, uh, so I think it's just how she has her hair and the look, makeup probably. Uh, it kind of resembles the same as what like Cardi B and stuff would do as far as looks and stuff like that. Um. 
Yeah. <laughs> but I was like, as far as the music video, it's fine. Um, it's just in the studio. You have, like, the different lights. And you have a whole bunch of dancers dancing. And I usually say that in songs. It's like, we're not going to do a lot when it comes to story and stuff like that. Just, yeah, have some dancers. Show off the dancers. Let them do their thing. Um, and so I, I don't have a major issue with this when it comes to that. Um, with the music video and stuff, but um, that's why I was like, it's okay, it's just the song and stuff I was trying to really feel. But I think it was that first half, the second half was okay. It was, the, the second half felt a lot better than that first half. Um, I don't know what's what was with the first half, but um, and it's not even her uh rapping on it, it was just when it comes to trying to go with the chorus and stuff, it kind of, I don't know. I think it's how she laid into it, but but it was okay. Um, it's something I wouldn't put on a playlist, um, though, just to be honest. <laughs> and I'm being truthful. I, I wouldn't put it on a playlist. Um, and if it was playing, I would still listen to it because there's nothing wrong with it. You can still dance to it. You can still groove to it. Um, hey, it's a it's a change up of a Missy Elliott beat. Hey. And it's not like Timbaland never like never done that before where he uh <laughs> uses uh Missy's beats for other artists cuz he did that with um uh uh what the freak is his name? I know he did it with Nas for that Nas and uh G Wan song, but he also did it with uh I think the song was called Ugly. Bob Sparks, there you go. Uh so like he's he's done that before. So he re uses Missy Elliott's beats and yeah, change up a little bit and then hey y'all y'all do y'all thing on this beat. <laughs> Cause that's what it seems like. That's always what it seems like. But I was like it's okay. Um, There's nothing wrong with that because it's people right, artists and stuff who got they start off by using artists' beats. They rap, do a song, and so make a song over somebody else's beat. So. Um, yeah, but it's cool. Uh, <laughs> but let me know what y'all think about this in the comments below. If you feel differently, that's perfectly fine. Y'all can let me know. Hey, y'all can say that this is a, the one of the biggest bangers ever. Y'all can let me know that. It's like I don't have a problem with that whatsoever. Um, it's just I I wouldn't I don't feel it as much, but you know, it is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> If you like this video, please put a like on the video. If you like, subscribe. If you more of my videos, please do. Thank you all so much for jumping on and giving me a try. I really do appreciate it. Please do take care of yourselves and each other. Peace and geekdom.